Workers in the Division of Health and Social Services at the head office in Glen Road, Scarborough, walked off the job today after they were paid a visit by PSA union leader Watson Duke. Mr. Duke addressed the workers in their office space, saying that they should not accept any excuses for the building to continue housing the workers without the necessary approvals. He raised an alarm about the chemicals used in the building. Mr. Duke warned that they should not fear threats of victimization because they are protected under the OSHA Act and they are entitled to pursue legal actions if it does occur. Section 20A is quite clear that no employer or the person acting on behalf of the employer can intimidate, coerce, or molest or threaten or discipline any worker because they have acted under this act. While addressing the media, Mr. Duke noted that close to 100 workers are situated in a building that has many infrastructural issues, including the lack of fire safety clearances for the building. He claims that people have fallen ill as a result of the air quality in the building. And I must say, the conditions are quite appalling. There's a situation we have a building that I believe was not designed for office staff, housing approximately 75 to 100 office staff. The toilet facilities outside, is it floods whenever rain comes heavily in the compound. Mr. Duke admits that he hasn't spoken to the Secretary of Health and Social Services, Claudia Groom Duke, but he says that she should not have allowed her workers to operate in such an environment. The division is expected to send out a release soon on the